Ansh Postacoglu is without a number of first team attackers at Tottenham. Related articles Related articles Related articles Tottenham are reportedly hoping to fast track Yang Min, Hai Ox arrival in North London after striking a deal for him during the summer. Injuries have hit Spurs attacking players particularly hard. Timo Werner and Mikey Moore are currently out, while Richarlison and Wilson Odobert face even longer spells on the sidelines. Spurs originally planned for Yang to join up with his new team, mates in January after sealing a transfer worth just over £3 million for him in July. But according to South Korean sports outlet Chosen, the North Londoners have now requested that the 18-year Old travels to England in mid-December. Despite his age, Yang has had a hugely effective season for Gang 1 FC in the K-League, scoring 11 goals and notching 5 assists. His duties in South Korea will be over by the end of the month, and he is now expected to take only two weeks of rest before embarking on his new challenge. And the Aussie head coach is likely to need as many hands on deck as he can get hold of once domestic action resumes, due to a hectic fixture schedule in December. Tottenham will compete in the Premier League, the Europa League and the Carabao Cup next month, before FA Cup action commences in January. Postacoglu will therefore hope that Yang is in a position to affect games straight away. The manager has already shown a willingness to put trust in talented youngsters. Moore is 16 months younger than Yang, and he has made eight first team appearances so far this season. Lucas Bergvall and Archie Gray, both 18, have also been handed frequent opportunities to impress. On top of bringing Yang on board earlier than scheduled, Postacoglu may look towards the January transfer window as an opportunity to bolster his squad. Spurs spent big during the summer but three of their big signings, Gray, Odobert and Bergvall, are still teenagers. In the same window they lost a handful of experienced campaigners such as Pierre, Emile Hoiberg, Giovanni Lo Celso and Emerson Royal. The need for a turnaround was given extra urgency just before the international break, with Postacoglu overseeing consecutive defeats to Galatasaray and Ipswich Town.